That's blog.com. I can't be on the petty blog. <laughs> so let's get into this one verbatim. The headline reads, Woman falls off cliff, dies while trying to take a photo at notorious Australian selfie spot. A 38-year-old woman tumbled to her death Saturday after she slipped on a barrier at a popular Vista point in the Australian state of Victoria, police said. Australia's Nine News identified the woman as Rosie Lumba and said she was with her husband and child at Baraka Lookout when she climbed over the safety barriers. The lookout gives a sweeping view of Grampians National Park and Lumba was trying to pose on the Picture Perfect Rock when she fell around 3 p.m. Witnesses told the outlet they could hear Lumba's screams, but no one was able to help her. It took first responders six hours to work their way up to the cliff face to recover Lumba's body. Graham Wood, a local tour guide, said he saw someone else scaling the barrier for a photo that day and believes Lumba fell just 30 minutes after he left. I was shocked, Wood said, adding that it was an awful way for people to learn a lesson about risking their lives at Baraka Lookout. I don't know how you could stop it from happening, but maybe this incident will help. It's a hard way to get people to adhere to what should be common sense. The warning signs on the 260 foot high Baraka Lookout are often ignored. Police have warned visitors in the past about going after the ultimate selfie in the Grampians. We regularly see dangerous photos and videos geotagged to the area where individuals have compromised their own safety to get a particular shot, police said. We also frequently work with local rescue teams on missions to bring individuals to safety who have ignored signage and climbed over safety barriers or fencing. Our missions do not always have successful outcomes. Mm, that's crazy. Now, mind you, she fell off this almost 300 foot cliff in front of her husband and son. I mean, can you imagine as a child having to witness such tragedy? That boy will have nightmares for years. That's just traumatic. I don't know what else to say, but keep in mind that all the photos you are seeing on your screen right now are from the same cliff that she fell off of. So it's safe to say that people only go there for perfect selfies or photo ops, not the experience and for what? Just so they can post it on social media and be like, look at me, look where I went, look what I did, I'm so cool, ooh. But it's not worth the risk. I'm not saying don't go out, don't have fun, but if you ignore the warning signs, literally signs that say don't go past this point and you still do it, that's just absurd. But I do feel for this family, for this woman, RIP to her. I don't know what else to say. Condolences. But y'all please be safe out there when y'all trying to be adventurous. But what are y'all thinking? We want to know, so leave your thoughts below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel for more. And don't forget to hit that bell to join the notification gang. Petsyblog.com signing off. You still there? Yeah, you. Since you are still here, be sure to support this channel by checking out our store and buying Petsy Blog merchandise, which should appear right under this video or in the store section of this channel, which is right here. What we have in store for you is an I Support Petsy Blog shirt and the Sips Petsy mug. Cause um, the tea we be having for you, honey. Mm -mm -mm. And also be sure to shop at www.talkyoshirt.com for some dope unisex shirts like Faith It Till You Make It, Ignore the Ignorant, I'm Coming for Everything They Said I Couldn't Have, All Black Lives Matter, and Fuck Corona because it's Fuck Corona, you heard? Oh, and don't forget to wear your masks. That's very important. These shirts do come with a free reusable mask, okay? Talkyoshirt.com. I'm out of here. Bye.